buddy. Where's your friend? Where's your buddy? You cannot be laying in the road like this. You can't be out here. It's not safe. It's not safe. You've been waiting with him? He's an old guy. Hey, buddy, did you get hit? Did you get hit? You're not big at all. Hey, buddy. What happened? What happened? You got some road rash all over you. You gonna be okay? It's like the, it, something. It broke his tooth. You gonna be able to let us pick you up? You gonna let us pick you up? If you try to pick up the front end, see how painful he is. Here, buddy. You're gonna be okay. Can I pick you up? You're okay. Oh, you're heavy, man. He may actually let you pick him up. You want me to do it? Do you want me to help you, or do you want me to get one side, or do you want me to help you? I don't know yet. Hold on. Because it's his back end, I think, is broken. I know, I know, I know, I know, I know, I know, buddy. I know, I know. I know, I know. I made it. I made a little pallet. <sighs> You're a strong boy. That's road rash all over the back of him. Okay, we got a pallet in here. You're okay. See? Did you wag your tail? You wagging your tail for me? Did you pick your leg up? Did you pick your leg up? Don't move. We're gonna get you help, buddy. Whatever you need, we're gonna do it, okay? Whatever you need. That tail wag tells me you're gonna be okay, huh? It does. It tells me you're gonna be okay. I prefer not. What's the matter, buddy? You like that bed? You like that bed, buddy? You're so scrappy looking. Corey. <laughs> Corey, would you like a puppuccino? Yes, please. We need that. We need Corey, that. would you like a puppuccino? You want a puppuccino? What do you think of the puppuccino? Oh, yeah. <laughs> I loved it. I loved it. You hungry? You want your food? You want your food? Oh. <laughs> Did he get in that bed like that again? He loves... Oh, buddy. He loves that bed. Okay. I know that's yummy. What are you doing? What are you doing? What are you doing? Oh, sweet boy. Let's go get ready. Let's go get ready. Let's go home, buddy. Oh, he's so cute. What's up, buddy? Susan, you want to hold his leash just in case? Yeah. All right, buddy. You want to get in there? We got Chase for you. He's not crying anymore. You know that guy? That's your buddy. Look who it is. Oh, look who it is. <laughs> who is that? No, no, don't, don't get up. Don't, don't get up. Don't get up. Oh, don't get up, buddy. He's going to be here with you. Yes. Oh, it's like he's saying, thank you. No, no, don't get up, buddy. So basically, um, he was really impressed with how well he's doing. Um, I asked them for a gurney when we were when we arrived, and they said, um, "I'll just kind of help pick him up." Before they could even come out to help me, he was already standing up from the crate, coming out, and he was ready to go. And I said, "Oh, well, he just did it all on his own. He just proves every time I turn around how strong he is and how resilient he is." He um, is very motivated uh, to be with people. He's so affectionate and so kind. So as they uh, took him in, they carried him into the back 
and um, he kind of disappeared, and I peeked my head inside to see what was going on, and they were removing the splint. They said, yeah, we're really impressed with, we looked at the charts and stuff, and, and we think that the, 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 if there is a hairline fracture, it's so insignificant that it's not going to be any kind of an issue with him, especially since he's having an issue with his um, hind end. Um, he's going to need an FHO for sure. Yeah. Um, and that's scheduled to come up uh, the 4th, and uh, we'll have him neutered at the same time. He was tested uh, for heartworms, and he tested positive, so that kind of stinks. But um, as far as his overall, they want to let his skin heal up because he's got several places that he's got a lot of road rash. Um, and but his Oh, my demeanor, God. Look at his face. Yeah, his demeanor is so pleasant. 